What's up everybody? In this video, I am going to show you how to add menu items to a Mac OS application. Uh, what I've got here is a standard template straight out of the box. I haven't done anything with it yet. This is just straight up. Um, it's a storyboard based application I'm working on here. However, I will be making a video to show the Swift UI version because I'm sure that's going to be a thing that you're going to be looking to do going forward. But for now, we're just going to do a storyboard. So I've got this menu here, format and view, right? This is just the standard one you get out of the box. I want to put an extra item in here and I'm just going to call it insert. And on there will be on the drop down menu, two items. And then we're going to hook that up to some code. So let's go ahead and get started here. What I'm going to do is just expand the outline here and I'll show you why in a second. So I'm going to bring up the library panel, shift command L. I'm going to search for a menu. And actually the one I want is a menu item. Now I have found sometimes when I drag, in fact, most of the time when I drag menu item off of here and, and sort of drag and drop it on the menu that I want up here on the storyboard, for some reason, it just, it just doesn't work. So what I do is I use the outline view. So I'm actually going to drag and drop this one here between format and view and let go and insert it there. So this way, what happens is you can see it's got it in there. But another quirk I've noticed with Xcode 11 and 12 on my system, and I don't know why I'm, I'm running Catalina here. Maybe that's the problem. Um, it doesn't show the title uh, at first either, right? You can see I've got a title here called item, which you get by default, but it doesn't always show. We're going to deal with that in a second. I want to finish building out the menu first. So Let's go back to this, right? I'm going to highlight item here again. You can see there's nothing on it. If I open up view, you can see got the menu with the options, right? So let's go ahead and add those options. So this time we want to use a menu. And what I'm going to do is again, I'm just going to drag it underneath item here and you'll see it'll add it in as a sub menu with three items. Well, for starters, I only want two. So I'm just going to delete one of those. Let's select the first one. I'm just going to call this one image. We're just going to give them names that are recognizable here and make it obvious for the code. And we'll call this one video, right? So we've got image and video. Now let's go back up to menu here and let's try and change this. I'm going to put insert and now it works. You'll see sometimes you have to edit the title a few times for it to accept this. I don't know why it's like that. It maybe it just happens to me, but anyway, if you get it, just try changing the title a few times. Eventually it'll show up and you can do it here. Now, right now, these are not hooked up to any code, right? If I run the was to run the application, you would see the insert menu, but image and video would be disabled because they're not linked up to anything. Now, there's a couple of different ways you can do this, uh, but the cleanest way and perhaps the most popular way, at least what I have found is you can very simply hook this up to your app delegate. So I'm going to control click on my app delegate here. Sorry, I'm going to option click. I got to get used to that. There we go. And it's going to open up a separate window or separate space here for me with the app delegate. And all I'm going to do is control and drag from image into my app delegate. I'm just down to here and I'm going to insert a new action. I'm going to call this insert image. And we're going to change this type from any to an NS menu item because that is what it is and hit connect. And that is all you need to do to hook it up to the code. So let's do the same thing again here with the video. Put another one underneath here. We'll just call this one video. We're going to insert an action, insert video, change it again to the menu item and hit connect. Now, obviously from here, you can do whatever you need to do and however you want to do it in your code here, right? So I'm just going to do something very simple. Um, just for the sake of this, I'm just going to have it print out. Um, you selected the image menu item. Let's do the same thing for the video, just so I can show you that the code is hooked up and working. Like so. Great. All right, let's save that. Can see they're all hooked up nicely because we've got our little circle here and you can see that it's highlighting on the storyboard there uh, image and video we're going to go ahead and run this it's going to take a couple of seconds to do the build there we go 
Okay, so we've got nothing on the window because we don't have any controls, right? But if you look up here on the macOS menu application bar, you can see we've got our format and our view, and now we've got our insert. And if I click on insert, I've got image and video. If I click on image, you're going to see down here in Xcode, it printed, you selected the image menu item. And if I do the video, you selected the video menu item. So that's it. We got everything we needed up and working. From here, you put in whatever code you want to do. And that is how you add menu items to a macOS application. If this video has been helpful, go ahead, like, subscribe. Uh, you can also reach out to me on Twitter at CompileSwift, and you can find lots more content like this at CompileSwift.com. Thank you.